Hey everybody, uh, it's been a little while, it's Brandon, I'm showing you um, what's going on with our Lucy tank. Uh, this is the 40 gallon tank in the wife's bedroom, and I just did a water change, so my plants are a little all over the place, my fish are a little on edge, but my turtle is lazy as can be. She is a stink pot musk turtle named Lucy. There you are. Hey little girl. And she's just about the cutest best little turtle we've ever had. I mean I like her other turtles a lot but this one has a lot of personality. She might not look like it because during the day she um during the day in the sunlight she just kind of hangs out and doesn't do a lot. But once the sun goes down and it starts getting dark in here, she kind of goes crazy and um, plays all over the tank and dances and hunts for food. And she's just so, so cool. So the wife loves watching her. Now we did get this stone structure with openings. The openings are big enough for the turtle so she doesn't get stuck under there. So that's pretty fun. Then she has her other log thing she could go hide in but today she feels like hanging out under her plants these are fake plants except for that there's a couple pieces of anacharis that are kind of tearing apart and floating everywhere but um back there that plant these plants and these are all fake but it makes lucy much more comfortable she's a lot more active with those plants and she hi kitten she spends a lot of time and those plants particularly, uh, just kind of wedging herself into them and hanging around. It's pretty good. She likes them a whole lot. Um, I still need to scrub the back glass. I replaced the water, but still need to scrub because back there is directly getting sunlight. So wherever gets direct sunlight naturally builds a little bit of algae. So I just need to scrub that off a little bit um, for filtration this tank is still running the Fluval 306 one of the better filters of all time I love these things very very much and I do have a surface skimmer so it's pulling water through the bottom through about here ish getting lower stuff and then pulling surface water all the oils and little things that are on the top of the water are going down into that. You can see where it's sucking down the the stuff and bubbling in there. And that's all going straight into the filter. So that's working perfectly good. Um, heat, I keep my turtle tanks at about 78 to 80 degrees, especially through the summer. In winter, I go a little tiny bit cooler just to give almost a more natural effect for the turtles. Um, and it also depends on your turtle what temperature they like. Temperature and pH of the water. So you have to kind of watch um, watch those certain things when you get different types of turtles. What are you doing, little girl? Look at that little pudge. Little tiny pudgy legs. You got pudgy legs. Hey. You got a pudgy leg. <laughs> little thing. So yeah, that was my quick little video today. Hit the like button if you love turtles, because I sure do. And we'll see you all later. Bye, guys.